All right, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my God. Get out of there. Get out of the tree. Something just picked up the giant bass. What's going on, everybody? Nick from 618 Fishing here, and welcome back to another fishing adventure. No worries over nickels and dimes, or a nine to five grind. I gotta get loose sometime. In a recent episode, I was fishing out at a pond with the goal of catching a giant mystery pond monster. Well, I was unsuccessful at completing that goal on my first attempt, but a lot of you wanted me to head back out there, so that is what I'm doing today. I've made it to the pond and obviously the main goal for today is going to be to catch that monster mystery fish, but to catch him, I actually have to spot him, which I have not, I have not seen him so far. So my second goal is going to be to catch some giant bass and catfish and to do so, I'll be needing some live bait. All right guys, here we go. Let's toss out this cast net and try to catch some live bait. The cast net was unsuccessful, so I'm gonna go ahead and try the old fashioned way of using a bobber and a piece of worm. There we go. Finally caught a fish, guys. I've still not seen that giant mystery fish. I'm not giving up, but I'm gonna go ahead and try and catch a giant catfish or a bass. All right, that's a pretty decent sized bait. We'll see what we can catch. All right, guys, something has it. Here we go. Fish on. This feels like a nice fish. All right, that bait wasn't out there for more than 30 seconds. Something already picked it up. What is this? That was a decent sized bait. Oh, oh my gosh. Still have not seen it yet. Whatever this is, it is putting up a crazy fight. Man, he is not giving up. Oh, it's a catfish. It's a catfish. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. Yes, yes, there we go. This is one of the coolest channel catfish that I've ever landed. He is all poofed up, his head is giant. What a cool looking fish. See you later, buddy. Yes. What's crazy is the fact that although I'm struggling to catch live bluegill, the one fish that I did catch I tossed out there and that channel catfish picked it up within 30 seconds. Hopefully I'll be able to catch some more bait, but that was awesome. There we go. All right, caught another bluegill. in the world. You guys, I just caught a little bass. I have a decent amount of bait. Let's see, I've got three bluegills and then I'm actually going to try and use this largemouth bass as bait. I don't know if it's gonna work. I've never tried it before, but I think I'm gonna try it today. All right, let's start with this pretty decent sized bluegill. See if anything goes for it. Oh, there's a fish. Holy cow. Something just took off with it. 
No, they dropped it. No, 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 no. All right, let's get it back over there. All right, guys, I think something has it. Here we go. Fish on. He was sitting right next to that tree. Oh, it's a bass. It's a really nice bass. Okay. Oh my gosh. Yes, there we go. Fish number two, guys. A nice bass. Awesome. See you later, buddy. I've been out here for a few hours, and although it is incredibly difficult to catch live bait, the big fish are biting fairly quickly. As soon as I get those bluegill out there, it seems like something is picking them up. Now, as far as the giant mystery fish goes, I have yet to see a single one. So I'm hoping they start making their appearance as the sun goes down, but we're just gonna have to wait and find out. I think it's time to try out this largemouth bass as bait. Oh my gosh, you guys, I think something actually picked it up. No way. Where is the heck is it? Oh my gosh. You guys. What is this? Oh my gosh, something actually got it. No, 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 it came off. It came off, it came off. No. Something picked it up and swam off into the deepest part of the pond. I cannot believe that just happened. All right, guys, I think something has it. I'm gonna give him a second to eat it. Here we go. There we go, fish on. No way, you guys, a bass ate it. No way. I cannot believe this fish just ate that giant bait. Yes. Oh my gosh, you guys. I cannot believe that just happened. See you later, buddy. Let's rig up another piece of bait and see what else we can catch. All right, guys, something just picked up the bluegill. All right, here we go. There we go, fish on. Another big fish, another big fish. Oh my gosh, this guy's fighting like crazy. What in the world is this? Oh, yeah, it's a catfish. It's a big catfish. Oh my gosh, he is pulling the kayak. Dang, this guy's strong. There we go. Holy cow, you guys. What an awesome catfish. Dang. See you later, buddy. I've only got one decent bluegill left, so it's time to try to catch some more bait, which is proving to be the most difficult thing about catching fish today. But here we go. I was unsuccessful at catching more bait, so I'm gonna have to work with what I have. And what I have is not very Impressive. I have one decent bluegill, another small bluegill. I think I'm gonna try out this big bluegill. 
Oh, something already picked it up, guys. No way. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh, it took off. Fish on. Oh my gosh, this is going crazy. What is this? Whatever this is, it completely took off. That was crazy. As soon as I casted this giant bluegill into the water, something picked it up. Oh my gosh, it is towing the kayak right now. This is wild. Oh, it's another catfish. There we go. Awesome. Another nice channel catfish. See you later, buddy. Today has been a crazy day of fishing. I've been trying to catch more live bait for the past hour and I am failing miserably. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. Also, I have not seen any of those giant mystery fish yet. The first video I filmed out here trying to catch one, I was seeing a few of them, but I have not seen a single one today and I've been out here for almost five hours. So I don't know, I'm gonna give it a little bit longer, but in the meantime, I'm gonna attempt to catch some more live bait. There we go, fish on. Oh, it's another bass. I'm gonna keep this guy for bait. There we go. I was finally able to catch three nice little bass that I'll be using for bait. Hopefully I'll be able to catch a giant fish. I figured I'd show you guys really quickly the setup that I'm using to catch these fish. This is a seven foot fast action, medium power spinning rod. On there I have a size 30 Pfluger President reel. The rig I'm using is a simple Carolina rig. I've got a 3 8 ounce barrel weight with a swivel and then about 12 inches below the swivel, I have a six aught Gamagatsu octopus circle hook. I'm gonna rig up one of those bass and see what we can hook into. It's been a while since I got my last bite on the live bait, so I think I might try using a suspended presentation instead of this bottom fishing presentation. Check out this rig. I've got a giant float with a pretty decent sized live bass on there. Let's see what we can catch. Something just broke me off. Darn. All right, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my God. Get out of there. Get out of the tree. Something just picked up the giant bass. Holy cow. I need to get him away from that tree. What in the world is this? Oh, it's a bass. What? You guys, how in the world? It's foul hooked. What? <laughs> that is crazy, guys. This guy obviously went for that giant bait, but he avoided the hook there. But when he swam off, he got foul hooked. See you later, buddy. Well guys, unfortunately I have run out of live bait, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it. I was also unsuccessful at catching that giant mystery fish today. But having said that, I still had a lot of fun using those giant live baits to catch those big catfish and bass. So if you guys enjoyed this episode, I'd really appreciate it if you left a thumbs up. Possibly think about subscribing if you haven't. I will catch you guys on the next one. Hello, and die, or a nine to five grind. 
I gotta get loose sometimes And try 